I've heard a lot about you, and you didn't disappoint with your win over Drew McIntyre today. With that being... It would be an honor. In my opinion, NXT is the top brand in WWE, and I'm only going to help make it stronger. I'm betting on that. And don't forget to take a moment to celebrate this achievement. You've earned it. Thank you, Mr. Regal. I promise you won't be disappointed with your decision. I hope not, but we'll find out soon enough. You're looking at the Blue Brand's newest superstar. Took longer than it Good for you. I'm going to do the same thing in NXT, but without the lame nickname. Whatever. I'd say I'll be watching on NXT, but I'll be too busy dominating SmackDown. But if you ever make it out of the minors, let me know. Hey, I heard you're going to NXT. Looks like I'll have some company. You signed with NXT too? Yeah, I just spoke with Regal. I think it's a great fit for my style, and I'll be able to compete for the Cruiserweight Championship. We should look... That's a good idea. Especially considering we might have targets on our backs coming in as the new guys. Look forward to competing with you there. Congrats, man. You too. Heard you got signed. Congrats. Thanks. What's the matter with you? What's the matter? You and Hector and Paragon all got signed, but no one wanted me, and now I'm stuck here while you guys are all moving on to bigger and better things. Comparing yourself to us isn't going to help. Your time will come, trust me. You just need to take a hard look in the mirror and see what you can change to capitalize on the next opportunity that comes along. That's good advice. But what if it wasn't anything that I did wrong? What if someone in WWE doesn't want me to succeed? What if I'm being held down? Bro, I think you've been spending too much time on social media. There are no conspiracy theories in play here. All right, but that is exactly what you would say if there was one. Chase, keep your head up and continue to work hard. <laughs> I gotta go clean up my locker. That's not code, is it? Like you're not trying to tell me there's a conspiracy theory against me? That I'm being locked down? Wink twice if I'm onto something. Chase? Congrats on getting signed to NXT. I think you're gonna do big things there. Thanks for saying that. Especially since we haven't always seen eye to eye. It's hard for me to see eye to eye with anyone these days. That's a joke. But nonetheless, this is always a proud day for us. But just remember, don't slip up and embarrass me or the other coaches, okay? So basically, don't do anything you would have done when you were starting out in WWE? Exactly. 
Good luck, kid. I'll be watching. And there you see the newest addition to NXT's roster making their way into the arena. If you ask me, I think he's going to do big things here. Well, nobody asked you, but I have to agree. This guy is the definition of superstar. Can I bother you for a selfie? I'd be so thankful. I asked Raul Mendoza when he was through here earlier, and he ignored me. Not that I'm bitter about it, and not that I'd love you to take him down in the ring, but if you wanted to, I wouldn't mind it. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Athens, Greece. Weighing in at 215 pounds, Mark Key. The killer instinct of the MMA cage is part of this competitor's DNA. Word is he was actually banned from competing in one MMA organization, but he's adjusted well to the rules of the WWE ring. Mendoza is here, an impressive talent with a bit of an attitude. It's the right attitude if you ask me, Saxton. And his opponent, representing Legado del Fantasma from Cordoba, Veracruz, Mexico, weighing in at 190 pounds, Raul Mendoza. He started in the Cruiserweight Classic in 2016, but now finally breaking through. Yeah, but at what cost? Well, he made his debut at 15 years old, over a decade, wrestling in Mexico and Japan. He brings his devastating hybrid of Lucha Libre and technical skills to every match he competes in. Looking into the eyes of this competitor tonight, you know he understands the significance of this match. This is an opportunity to make headway on the roster. And he's facing Raul Mendoza, the technical assassin representing Legado del Fantasma. 
Mendoza is just as mean as they come. When the intimidating Legado del Fantasma wants to send a message, this is the guy they call. Tossed around like a rag doll. Just a barrage of stumps. Placing them into the corner. Wicked clothesline. This is what you call high risk, high reward. Taking flight. Diving body splash. And a good strong kick out there. He isn't going to go away that easy. Start counting, Saxton. One, two, three. We could be here four. all day. Power. I think you're right. And Mendoza can't send a message if he gets outmatched like that. Punishing power slam. Mendoza looking powerless to every attack. Yeah, Mendoza is having trouble fighting back. Boom! What a right! Gosh. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Gotta hurt. Wicked clothesline. Oh my, what a splash. Shoulder shoots up before two. He's still got life in this matchup. And Mendoza answers back. Hooked up. Driven down. Will this be enough? His arm shot off the mat before one. I'm just as shocked as everyone else, Cole. His opponent included. He has him right where he wants him. Off the top. That one fails to land. Missed the mark. Wrapping the arm over that top rope. Oh, punishing their opponent. Treading all over their opponent. Attacking the arm. Great way to break down your opponent. And there's the takedown. Uh oh. Jarring impact. That unraveled on Mendoza. Mendoza sidesteps that. Overhand connects. Nicely done. Inverted scoop slam. He's able to fend off the attack. Take it. Great reversal. Uh-oh, clearing off the announce table. Uh, this is about to go from bad to worse. This is not going to be pretty. I don't want to see this happen. Sliding back into the action. <laughs> Taken down. What is this superstar looking for? Legs are great by now. The arms are trapped. This won't end well. Oh, big stop. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Up and over. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Everyone get out of the way. These two are abandoning all restraints. What is he doing here? Oh, no, get down from there. Get down from there. You don't have to do this. Are you so fine? You know, the best time we could have gotten some help out here would have been before they went through the table, Saxton. Someone to put some sense in their mind before doing something so reckless. Mendoza is being carefully measured now. 
Oh, looks like we're gonna see it! Selena Del Sol! And Mendoza's late. And that's all she wrote. Here is your winner, Mark Key. This was as dominant a win as I've ever seen, guys. This is what you get when you have complete confidence and control of the situation.